Final Fantasy 13 2, the story so far. What the? Wait for it? Now! Paradox is dissipating. I'm in pain and I can barely breathe. Yo, yo, what up, hype man? It's your boy Sports 90 back on the channel today for you guys with some more of that Final Fantasy 13 2. <clears throat> yeah, I know, I know, I know. I've been playing this a lot. This is the only game I've been playing for the last couple days, but I love this game. I'm having a lot of fun. If you joined me yesterday, you've seen that I was on the stream for like five hours straight. So, <clears throat> and that's the most I've done in a long time. But uh, yesterday, I guess I was tired because at the end of it, I forgot. I didn't know where I needed to go. I didn't know what I needed to look for. So I was extremely upset with where, where everything was going. But that being said, guys, we figured out what we need to do. So we're going to jump into it and get that rolling. So that being said, we're about to get into it. Final Fantasy 13 2. Let's ride. Oh. All right, so we're going to come back to Ereba. We have missed a lot. Well, did we, well, we didn't miss a lot, but there's something we missed. So we're going to jump back in here, and we're going to go back in here and get what I missed. And I can't even believe I missed it. Like, I could have swore I went to this spot and done this exact thing, but <clears throat> for some reason, I didn't get it. So um, it's not here. We're not going to fight right now. We're just going to go ahead and go. So we're going to pass all of it, and then we're going to uh, continue where we was at. So if I run into anything, we're not even going to fight it. <laughs> um, let's see. Where was it at? Yeah, I got to go all the way around. And there's also, I think I missed the artifact in Sunleth Waterscape. But I forgot where it was at, so I have to look and see where that artifact was. Oh, wow. What's going on? Okay. My game is uh going crazy. Okay. Maybe if they disappear. Um... Why are we doing this? Stop. Okay. Um, not liking this at all. You gotta be kidding me, man. Uh, I'm gonna have to restart because I can't do this. Yeah, I can't do this. Gosh dang it, man. Uh, I'm gonna have to make it trek again. Like, it started doing that yesterday, but it wasn't that bad. Like,. I don't know, like the frame rate just like stuck. So we're just gonna have to see what 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 we can do to help that out. So since we've already done the story so far, we're not gonna do it again. I should have saved it where I was at at least. Final Fantasy 13-2. The story so far. This is going to start me right back over there, I think. Ever. All right, hopefully we don't glitch out again. All right, so yeah, it's gonna start me right back over here again. That freaking sucks. Oh well. Hopefully, we just I'm just hoping we don't glitch out again. Bruh. 
Bro, you gotta be kidding me. Somebody tell me if I fight him, it goes back. Wow, okay. I mean, at least I know now. Okay, so at least I know now that if I fight, it goes back. Okay. That that's kind of crazy though, but whatever. Let me get some more Kasterium. Where where am I at? I'm at 34, so 1,500 more, and I'll be able to go do my stuff. Am I going the right way? Yeah. Okay, so it's not doing it no more. Okay, okay. So maybe I just had to get that one fight out the way. And I'll be happy when I'm able to start buying potent silver and um, power silver and all the other stuff. And there's also something I need to go back to. Um, I need to go back to the, how do you say it? Archide or, or, or Archite, whatever. I gotta go back to that um, to get, uh, to, to, to get 100%, because there's a way I can get a Chocobo to fly up to that one spot. Yeah, this is, I could have swore I went down here before. I could have swore I did. I can't even, I can't even swing the okay. Yeah, I could have swore I went down here, but I guess not. Enjoy. All right. No way. Like, what is going on? Let me go try to see if I can find something real quick. Maybe the... Okay. Good Lord. Like, I don't know what's going on. I might need to shut my Xbox down. All right, so we got another one of the connected crystal stains. God, it just makes me mad. Because I know. Because I know for a fact I went down here and checked this. Oh, shoot, hold on. One more. Okay. See, I don't, I hate doing these, though. Nope, that's not it.
There we go. schedule. Now we find the gate and its artifact. There might be other things to discover too. It looks like everything's back to normal. Yep. And uh there we go. So now we're gonna get back on to the fight and stuff. Man that uh, man that kinda upsets me though because be honest. Cause I know for a fact I went down there. Uh, hold on. There's something I need to go check out. There was, um, yeah, there's a floating artifact over here. Just as the light begins to fade to the yeah, I was looking at that whenever I was trying to go through everything. Trying to figure out how to get through that gate. That is a artifact, so that'll be able to open some kind of gate. Yeah. I don't know what gate it'll open, but it'll open some kind of gate. I don't know if it'll open this gate over here or what. Go. So now should be able to get over there somehow. I mean, we have to get over there. Um, let's see. How do we get over there? Okay. <clears throat> we might be able to get the artifact from completing this, what you call it. And there's a chocobo somewhere, too, that I can go. And there's a, uh, there's a fragment. Um... On top of a building somewhere. That's it. You deserve a treat. Should be able to get up there. I just forgot how. I think there's a chocobo somewhere. Yeah, 
because all that's water. I can't go over there. Oh, but I need to talk to. Okay. I hate that. <laughs> I hit the wrong one. Oh well, it'll be alright. Oh, okay, this how. Okay. Erba, this was their home. But now they're frozen in Cocoon's crystal pillar, never to return. They slept for centuries. And then they awoke again, in our time. Though they came from Grand Pulse, they became Cocoon's saviors. So you're saying they traveled through time to save the future? Yeah, I guess they did in a way. All right, let's go up the stairs. <clears throat> or nah. Oh, I thought there might have been something back here. Oh, yeah. It looks like an Oracle drive. Yeah. Stop. <gasps> Sarah! Changed. But that's impossible. If you change the future, you change the past. <laughs> it keeps changing? <laughs> change is the constant. <laughs> Understand, there are many Yules. Caius. Wait, I saw you. My sister was fighting you. What are you doing here in this time? I learned of your journey, 
leaping back and forth along the timeline. Yule has been watching everything you do. No. She's been watching us? Yes. I see you understand the significance of that. Then you must also understand that I am here for a reason. Your actions have necessitated the strictest sanctions. Hey, hold on a second. Oh, what shoot. do you mean, sanctions? I must protect the sanctity of the timeline. Caius! I think I might be a little overpowered for this now. Since I spent 22 years doing this. Ah, uh, that's okay. Nope. for your crimes in blood. Well, I love this cutscene is being lagged out now. That's fantastic. Guys, I don't know what's going on. Stop this, Caius. I am not going to fight you. Times have changed. I'm not the Caius you once knew. <sighs> to change history is a sin. It's too late. The timeline has already changed. But must we accept this, Yule? If you change the future, you change the past. You can remold history as your heart desires. Let's go now, before you are made to witness more. Now we'll grab this artifact. That should open that gate, I think. An artifact, Poopa. What does Caius want? No. Yule, she seemed to know all about the Oracle Drive. Did she come to solve the paradox too? No, I think she came to... Wait a sec, I... Something's not right. Uh, what? What's wrong? Uh, sorry, it's nothing. Just nerves getting to me. I thought maybe I was forgetting something really important.
All right, so before I head to the gate, we ain't even know we're near close. We're 90%, but we can't get until I change. We can't get to the other side of that. So let's go see. Is there a chocobo? Yeah, there's a chocobo right there. Okay. So we'll grab that chocobo real quick. And then we'll go. Where am I going? Okay. I'm slow. Yeah, we'll grab that. We'll grab that chocobo. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, there's nothing I can do about that. Okay. Until the timeline is fixed. But I know. You see up there? That's where I got to get to. I'm not worried about that gate right now. Wait, there's something up here. I can't mog right now. Okay, I'll, I will come back and get that in a minute. Yeah, there, let me, where's it at? It's right there, so if I can... I gotta get up here somewhere. <clears throat> yep, bam. Alright, so now I dismount here. Over there, Mom. I I I don't know if it's an artifact Idiot. or if it's just a fragment. Now, let's see. I don't want to fight right now. There's also that other thing I just seen before we came up here. And then before I go to that gate, I want to go back to Arch Out, Arch Out, or Arch Light, however you say it. I want to go back to that and uh, explore that 100%. And then, uh, crap. And then, uh, be well, well, I won't be done with it because I got to get the fragments for it, but. Don't want to fight right now. Okay, so now let's go to, to the Historia Crux. Let's go back to... Oh, yeah. Time and memory frozen in crystal. Arch out. Fear and Arch out. I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, yeah, we got to go grab a chocobo. I got to go talk to one of them girls. Grab a chocobo and then... Uh, Make my way over there and jump across to get a hundred percent of the map. What I really need to do too, I really need to um I really need to start getting the fragments for everything. I'll probably start doing that on the next video. Like I'll start looking stuff up on how to get the fragments. Um and I'll probably start doing that on the next video. You're one of us now. In fact, you may be the bravest of us all. Here, take this chocobo. You deserve it. Yeah, I kept on saying that it sucks not being able to have a chocobo, but I forgot about that part. I forgot happened to talk to her to get the chocobo. So now we go here, and that will give us our... Uh, 100%. We still got, we still got a, I don't remember how many what's cards we got. We still got a bunch of, um, fragments to get though. I know, I think I know one of the fragments comes from beating that thing, but, um, not right now. I 
I might get a fragment out of this case up here, too. That is your 100% there. Yep. Uh, there's still a bunch of uh, fragments and stuff I got to get. I just forgot how to get them. Uh, but, uh, yeah. All right, so now we're going to return back to the Historia Crux and go back to... Yeah, see, I got four more fragments that got to go there. Um, got another fragment. I think I know where the fragment for that one is, but I forgot. Um, so I still got two fragments here. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to start doing. I'm going to start looking up how to get the fragments, and I'm going to come back on the next video and start doing that. Uh, yeah, 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 I got all the fragments for there. So, let's go ahead and go here. Let's go back and hit this gate. Um, and then uh, we should be good to go. Hopefully, I go back to where I was close to the gate. Yeah, okay, that's good. I'll probably run into something if I get to the gate. Oh, no. Surprise, surprise. She was the same. The same face. The same voice. But even so, she didn't know me at all. You mean you? Yes. Well... No questions? Seems to me that if I ask, you'd have a hard time trying to answer. I know what it feels like, not being able to explain how you feel, so I won't yeah. ask. Thanks, Sarah. We'll talk about it soon. Sure. Lightning. Nolan and I traveled to Erba. You wouldn't believe how much happened to us there. We found a prophecy that the Seeress of the Farseers had recorded. We saw a young girl called Yule, just like the Seeress. And we met a man named Caius, the man you were fighting in my dream. I guess what worries me the most, though, is that Nolan looks sad. Sadder than I've ever seen him. And there's something else, too. The strange thing that both Caius and Yule said about the past. If you change the future, you change the past. I'm afraid of what that might mean for us. When Noel and I solved the paradox, we changed the future. Does that mean the past of hope and the others has also changed? All right, here we go. Thanks, Sarah. No, a new timeline has been created. When a parallel world is unlocked, the uh, zero in the year is replaced with an X. For example, 1X AF is 10 years after the fall of Cocoon. Same as 10 AF, but the people have different memories as they led different lives. You can still return to the original date and location at any time by using the Historia Crux. Yep. See, there's a whole bunch of stuff that, that I still haven't... Yeah, we haven't got close to getting to, so we're going to try to get all of it, too. Because I don't think I've gotten all of it, but we're going to try to get all of it. At the summit of Yashus stands the ruins of the Farsia city, Padra. This was the capital of a flourishing civilization storied in the annals of Grand Pulse. Here, the young Hope Estime is leading the academy in an effort to learn more about the mysterious Oracle Drive. However... This world is not like the world of 10 AF that Noel and Sarah had visited previously. Things have changed. The sun is back in the sky. The eclipse is over. Or, it never existed in the first place. 
history here has changed. If the paradox didn't happen. So we still got all the same exploration. Then maybe Hope never had any reason to come here. There's still the Oracle Drive. Maybe that would have been enough of a draw for him. Only one way to find out. <laughs> Wait, there's some... Some equipment. That I want to look at. Hypno Crown. Feral Speed. What does that do? Oh, okay. That that ain't bad though. Eight plus ten. Taken. Okay. Thought I got something else. I don't know what that. What was that a was that a monster thing? Was that an adornment? Yeah. Okay. I didn't know what that was. All right. I should still be able to. I said, I should still. Really? Is you gonna come up behind me like that though? Whenever I get to hope is when I'll start uh when I'll do my Crystarium stuff. Hey, we got it. Maybe there's the bus. There's something floating here. Over there, Mom. All right, the pearl necklace. Let's see. What we got. I still gotta get a chocobo. It's a gate down there. I still gotta get a chocobo and uh, come down here and jump on there. But anyway. Yeah, we're, yeah we might be a little bit overpowered because of us getting stuck for a while. was a different Yule. A Yule from the future. What? Huh. So, you don't know me either. I know about you. I've been watching you both. You can see the future, can't you? I can trace the timeline. I see the future and lead others along the correct path. I came here to confirm something I already know. You and I are the same. What do you mean? You too can show others the way. Wait. I don't get it. How are we the same? It looks like Yule lives in this time, too. No, are you okay? Yeah, it was just so unexpected. Threw me for a loop.
She said I was the same as her. I wonder what she meant by that. She also said you can show others the way. It sounded like I'm supposed to do something. Like a mission or a destiny. Maybe your job is to... show us the true timeline. You mean like what I'm doing now? Changing the future and all that? Yeah, I'm. Uh, I love this game, but it's very time. confusing. Solved the paradox, and met two girls who looked exactly the same. And now, at last, we found our way back to Hope's Oracle Drive. He'll be waiting for us, or perhaps he won't. Maybe after all this time, Hope has forgotten us. All right, we're gonna see. I'm trying to look around, see if there's anything floating. I was afraid of what would happen if I was here. I guess the ruins were interesting enough. They didn't need the paradox to draw them here. The sun feels. Oh! Crap! I still can't get them. Okay. Why is that special? I don't know why that's special. Just trying to look through what they got. Okay, nothing really. Okay. Thank you for shopping. What? Did right, I miss something? I'm with the cat. I've been here for a while. However, okay. There is a floating box up here in the top. Here we go. Yeah. Work is going very smoothly. Oh, I gotta throw it over there, I guess. Which is weird. Idiot. Uh, Hey, I found the old battery. There you go. So I can go back to that timeline now and bring him the old battery. And actually, I can I think I found the other thing too. Director, who are you waiting for? I don't know, <gasps> but I think they'll be here soon. Whoa, hold up. In a world where the paradox was solved, the eclipse never darkened the sky in the first place. No one remembered that Noel and I had been here. But even so, Hope was there, waiting for us. Of course, his memories had changed. We had our ten-year reunion all over again, as if our last meeting had never happened. When we explained his memories had changed because the paradox had been dissolved, Hope believed us without question. And then... I have something I want to show you. to identify the location or circumstances. There is one thing we're sure about, however. And remember, we don't know what era this is. Lightning is alive in that place. In my memory, Lightning disappeared after the battle with Orphan. But she's living somewhere in the future. So it's not just a dream, is it? She's out there. Then I'm going to find her. Koopa Koopa? And you will find her, Sarah. After all, you traveled through time and found me. 
Many years of research have finally borne fruit. It all began with the Oracle Drive. We excavated it from ruins many centuries old. Yet it recorded an image of Cocoon, supported on a pillar of crystal. It was an impossibility, an enigma. Impossible, but a reality nonetheless. This is when I learned what I must do. If it was possible to journey through time and look into the future, then it must also be possible to travel backwards and change the past. Right. I wanted to change history, make things better, not just bring lightning back, but Vanille and Fang and my mother. So that's what your research was about. Chasing the impossible, you might say. But you've made me realize something. It's clear to me now we are not the only ones who are intervening in history. Oh? The past has already been changed. Mm. Sarah, you are the only one who remembers a time when lightning survived the fall of Cocoon. Oh, yeah? Director! Ah. Necessarily rewritten. It could be the original prophecy restored as it once was. Perhaps a continuation of the first recording. If this is showing us the future, then someday Cocoon will fall. Noel, you told me in your time Cocoon didn't exist like it does now. Yeah, it came to ground long before I was born. After it happened, the whole world just fell apart pretty much. But who made it fall? Could it have been Caius? No. He couldn't do that. When is Cocoon supposed to fall? How many years? Is it soon? No. Not for a couple of centuries. Oh, that's a long time from now. I mean, none of us will even be alive to see it. <sighs> but others will. <laughs> Cocoon will fall into Grand Pulse. Imagine the catastrophe. Think how many lives will be destroyed. Right. That's the future I lived in. It doesn't have to happen. No, we can change the future. We can stop Cocoon from falling and make your world a better place. Yeah, but how? You think you can go to the time when it falls and hold it up yourselves? Do you even have a gate to take you there? Well, we... It might not be necessary to travel to this specific time and place. How so? The future depends on what we do now, right? Yes, there is a chance Cocoon will fall, but we can start working now to prevent it from happening. Right. But what if you can't, Hope? We can at least work to mitigate the damage. If we begin our research now, we have time. Then, should Cocoon indeed fall, we can help protect the planet and save the victims. Okay, let's do it. We could try to solve things at the other end, in the future. Uh -huh. While you start preparing in the here and now. Yes, let's change the future. If you change the future... If, if you, you change, change the future, future you, you change, change the, the past. past. Sarah? Okay. It's nothing. Hope, thank you for the help. Time will separate us, but we'll share a common goal. Hmm. Hope dreamed of changing the past. The weight of history drove him forward. But now... He's turning to face the future. A future even more frightening than the past. Sarah, do you believe too? Do you believe in your own past? Alright, so... Well, I'm not even gonna put my face up because I gotta talk to both of these real quick. We tried so hard to save the pillar, together with Snow. Was it all in vain? 
It was bound to collapse over time. There was no stopping it. Why did Caius interfere? Lightning was fighting in Valhalla. That's where I met her. And that's when she told me to come and find Sarah. I see. Valhalla, otherwise known as the Unseen World. I think Lightning wants us to fix the timeline. Put it back how it was. Maybe that's why she gave me the power to travel through time and control monsters. She was unable to do anything on her own, so she turned to the one person she trusted more than anyone. Yes, it is possible, although the idea raises even more questions. Listen, Hope. What are we supposed to do if we want to save the future? The space-time is twisted and must be straightened. Find the largest paradox and resolve the contradictions. Tell me, Noel, looking back from the future, what was the most dramatic event in history? <sighs> the fall of Cocoon, no question. Wait, do you think someone created a paradox to make that happen? Assuming such a thing is possible, then yes, maybe. Again, hypothetically speaking, I wonder if the man that Lightning was fighting is involved. If he is, we're in big trouble. I shall try to avert the tragedy. Then, just maybe, you will have homes you can return to. Believe in your future. We tried so hard. It was bound. No. You know, I started this journey hoping to find my sister. But now, I want more. I want to save the future. So do I, Sarah. So do I. Time to travel again. Koopo? Find the gate and the key, Koopo! Right now, we don't have a clue where the artifact might be. There are still some places we haven't checked out. We should try asking some of the people around here. They might know something that will help. Uh, I can go up in there. Uh, I'm wondering for sure if there's anything up there or what. All right, so no, there's nothing. There, there's nothing. Wait, hold on. Something floating right there? No, I thought it was. But this is not. I need to start talking to some of the people too, because I think that's how I get some of the um, fragments. I wish something would happen. Um, like doing side quests and stuff. Various records of there was a spell to. Some it was nope. a forbidden. The people of the past. If like if it's not a live thing, I'm not really worried about it. Important relic. Oh, wait, here we go. Alright, there's a mysterious artifact. And now the gate is down there, I think, right? Yep. I still can't go over there yet though. Now we gotta find out which gate it belongs to. Just this moment, I felt the disturbance coming from the mountains. My bubble gate appeared there, Kubo. There's two gates, actually. Let's see. Where she's the director came. The area okay. where they found. That's fine. Yeah, if they don't. So let me go grab this chocobo so I can go down there. I'm gonna talk to him real quick. Where is everyone getting their info? Excuse me, I don't mean to take up too much of your time, but did you see some strange lights last night? Someone witnessed three stars falling from the sky. I thought it could be a meteorite of some sort, but there's no evidence of that anywhere. It's possible it burned up before it reached our atmosphere. If you see anything that looks out of place, please let me know. All right, let me see. Les is very interested in the reports of three fallen stars. I would love to find out. Okay. I'm counting on you. Come to me if you notice anything strange. By the way, the witnesses noticed something interesting about the stars. They said that all three of them were different colors. Three different colored stars falling from the sky. 
Sounds like it could be connected to something quite mystical, don't you think? Yeah, see, that's I think it's how you get a bunch of the artifact or the bunch of the um, the fragments. This can't be. This is horrible. Can you spare a minute to listen to my ramblings? We uncovered a stone tablet, only to have it broken into pieces by some monsters. We hadn't even deciphered the engravings yet. We thought we had made the discovery of a lifetime, but now that dream has turned to dust, literally. I would give my right arm and more to go back in time and retrieve it before it gets damaged. Uh, let me see. Marlowe's allowed monsters to smash a stone tablet uh, that his team was in the process of decoding. You're going okay. to search for the tablet? Don't be absurd. Like I told you before, it shattered into a million pieces. It's gone. No other relic compared to that tablet in value. I don't see how you'd be able to get your hands on something like that. I don't remember. Wait, is that? This can't be. That's the tablet that shattered into yep, pieces. Yep, okay, I already found it. Okay. Where did you get it? It's... It's the real thing. The stone tablet tells the story of an ancient myth. According to some legends, the people of Cocoon and the people who lived on Pulse many years ago were born from the same ancestors. Can you imagine people from two different worlds being related by blood? It turns out the people on Pulse spoke a language quite similar to ours, so the legend may not be as far-fetched and absurd as some may think. I think we finally found a piece to a very important puzzle. The puzzle of our history, our background, our evolution. Yes, that's how you find a lot of the fragments. Uh, I don't think I have anything to do with the... Do you know some people out there? I don't think that I did any kind of research on any of the stars or anything, so... I'll take a look if you find it. The okay. witness is clear. Okay, so yeah, that's from this timeline. Okay. Remember the purge, apparently? Why do people like cats? If apparent, I wonder if it'll... Yeah, I gotta start talking to people. Have you heard about this legend? Many years ago, there was a young girl who worshipped the seeress of Padra. With much training and dedication, the girl secured herself a position as one of the protectors of the seeress. But when war broke out in the city, the girl was fooled by the enemy and wound up betraying the one she set out to protect. Charged with treason, the girl faced severe punishment. She was turned into a seeth and was forced to wander the Yashes Masif for all of eternity. According to the legend, she's still there, waiting for someone to defeat her and help put her soul to rest. I don't know how much truth there is to that story, but if you ever spot a seat in the ruins, you should do it justice and kill it. You'd be doing it a favor by putting it out of its misery. Okay. Yep. Duncan tells Noel and Sarah that according to legend, the girl who once betrayed the Sirius of the Farseers still suffers her punishment as a wandering seat. The legend is to be believed. There is a chance that you find a seath uh, and put the poor girl's soul to rest. If you okay. want to set her free, even though she used to be a oh, human shit, okay. being, she's a monster now. Stay on your toes out there, or you'll end up losing your life. All right, so I got that. So what I might end up doing, to be truth be honest, I've been praying. Everything changed. A lot of time has. I used to, be, but I've come. Alyssa, and the, isn't that a street? Okay. Although even at the let me go get this so let, so let me grab this chocolate ball real quick so that I can go get that spot. But there's also somebody up here. The more we do, little by little, we're fine. The secret's okay. hidden. That's fine. Carbuncle figuring. All right, so. If a paradox, I wonder if it'll be. Nope. I might end up the going back. The director may soon. No matter how. I might end up going back to what you call it and try to get some fragments. Let's see, where are we at? 
It's up here. Okay. So, yeah. Oh, I already got it. Okay. Alright, so... Let me, uh... I'm going to go to that gate. Oh, I got another one? Oh, that was different. Okay, that's a different one. Okay. 